scientists have just found what appears to be the smallest black hole ever detected. Meet G3425, a binary system located about 5,800 light years from Earth. This system contains a massive red giant star, about 2.7 times the mass of the Sun. But the real star of the show is what you can't see, a black hole, potentially the smallest ever discovered. This black hole is nestled within a range scientists call the mass gap. It's so small that until now we weren't even sure black holes like this could exist. Yet here it is, defying expectations. Most black holes we've detected are at least five times the mass of the Sun, sometimes much bigger. But the black hole in G3425 is tiny in comparison sitting at just around 3.6 solar masses. Scientists call this range of 3 to 5 solar masses the mass gap because they've rarely found black holes of this size before. It's like finding a rare coin that fills a gap in your collection. Until now, they thought it might be impossible for black holes in this range to form after a star explodes, but G3425 just flipped that theory on its head. To put it in everyday terms, imagine you've always thought elephants could only weigh between 10 and 20 tons. Suddenly you find one that's just 3 tons. It doesn't make sense, right? But there it is, walking around, challenging everything we thought we knew. So how did scientists even know this tiny black hole was there if we can't see it directly? Well, they used a clever method. Instead of looking for x-rays or other bright signals that black holes usually give off, they looked at how the red giant star in the system is behaving. Think of it like this. You're watching a dance, but you can't see one of the dancers. You can only see the other's movements. By tracking those movements, you can figure out there's an invisible partner pulling the strings. Using data from two powerful tools, the LAMOS telescope and the Gaia satellite, Scientists noticed that the red giant in G3425 was moving in a way that could only be explained if something massive was tugging on it. That something turned out to be the smallest black hole we've ever detected. So instead of relying on bright flashes or radiation, they mapped the motions of the visible star to uncover the hidden black hole. Here's where things get even stranger. This tiny black hole doesn't just break the mold with its size, its orbit is throwing scientists for a loop too. The black hole and the red giant are in what's called a wide circular orbit, meaning they're quite far apart from each other and their orbit is nearly perfectly circular. Now this is odd because typically when a star explodes into a black hole, you'd expect some chaos. A lot of material gets blasted off and that usually makes the orbit more elliptical or stretched out. But not here. This black hole orbits the red giant almost as if nothing dramatic ever happened. Scientists are scratching their heads, trying to figure out how such a smooth circular orbit could form after something as violent as a supernova. It's like expecting to see a bumpy, crooked road after an earthquake, but instead you find a perfectly smooth highway. This throws a wrench into our understanding of how binary systems evolve, and it's forcing scientists to rethink some of their theories about black hole formation. So what does this discovery really mean? Well, it turns out there might be a lot more small black holes out there than we ever thought. For years, scientists believed that black holes in this size range were either super rare or just didn't exist because they were too hard to form but G3425 is changing that. Thanks to new technology like Gaia and LAMOS, we're able to detect black holes without relying on the usual X-ray signals. This opens up a whole new way to hunt for these elusive objects. In fact, scientists believe that there could be hundreds, if not thousands of low mass black holes hidden across the Milky Way, just waiting to be discovered. The G3425 system is proof that our methods for finding black holes are evolving, and we're just scratching the surface of what's out there. Now, here's why this discovery matters on a cosmic scale. G3425 isn't just another black hole in space. 
It's reshaping how we think about how black holes form and evolve. For decades, scientists believed that black holes could only form within certain size ranges. If a star was too small, it wouldn't have enough mass to collapse into a black hole. And if it was too big, it would form a massive one. But this little black hole in the mass gap defies that thinking. By studying G3425, scientists now have new data to test their theories of stellar evolution and supernova explosions. This discovery doesn't just fill in one gap. It opens up new questions about the life cycles of stars and the hidden black hole population in our galaxy. All in all, this little guy is like the chihuahua of black holes. Small, but still capable of packing a punch. Sure, it's not going to devour galaxies or bend light from across the universe like its larger cousins, but don't let its size fool you. Even a small black hole like this still has an immense gravitational pull, and it's powerful enough to warp space and time around it. So while it may be the runt of the cosmic litter, it's still something you wouldn't want to get too close to. And who knows, maybe one day we'll find an even smaller one and call it the teacup black hole. Just imagine explaining that to your friends. Don't forget to watch the video on the right and subscribe. Thanks for being part of Cosmonology.